Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, and there is something really strange going on. I don't have time to talk. Somehow, Skeleton Prime has just spawned. I didn't summon him. I don't mind losing this fight right now, but Jesus. Oh, man, this is... How did I fall to my death? Anyways, <laughs> I really hope he despawns. Because I'm not ready for him. He is... Insane. Let's just double... Oh, thank goodness. Also, if you check, there's been a lot of changes. I've been slowly working on redoing the house or mansion whatever you want to call it so all of this is going to change and I apologize right now for any lag I just woke up and I haven't even gotten breakfast or coffee anything like that yet I just wanted to get some digging done because I'm low on some resources mainly granite and marble but, since we're here, let me show you all something. This is... where is it? Oh, it's over there. Crap. I'm not gonna make it. Yep, didn't make it. Anyways, this is still hard mode. <laughs> I have died so many times in just hard mode that I don't even know really how to explain it. Uh, that's a gas pod shooting me. Alright, here we go. This is what I wanted to show off. Mainly so now I can rate it. This is a... Uh, what is this called? <laughs> it's a sky island made of clouds and stuff. Normally there would be harpies, sometimes weapons. But that has been needed and needed and needed. Uh, loot all. Yeah, uh, here's a harpy. I got a hurtless. Hurtless? Hurtful? little cutlass right here so that's gonna make it so much easier to get this done and kill off them I'll probably come up here later and mine out some of their blocks and stuff you can't make these at least I don't think so you might be able to get some type of machinery anyways that's the uh, little harpy island Oh, go away. And I have a little guest. Who moved into a nice little abode above the mushroom gardens. So let's go say hi to him and see what he has. Oh, let me get that star. This is Truffles. Also has that. That's a little depressing that the mushrooms are his children. We can summon a baby truffle. have no idea what that does. This helps to spread once you get um, used by the Clemenmanter, Clemenmanter, whatever. Whatever. And it's used by that to spread the mushrooms but I've done a good job this is now a full mushroom biome and look here we're growing a mushroom forest yay yeah that's something I just want to do mainly because it's slowly going to help stop the crimson which is spreading faster than I can do anything uh, all this 
is now crimson, and it's spreading at a rate that I don't know how to stop it. Uh, wolf. I'm a still wolf. You're just a wolf wolf. Wolf wolf. Anyways, I need to really gather some more of the wood and everything. I might go into my multiplayer map and steal some. Whoa, hello, you're new. Mushroom ladybug. Does it drop anything? No. Wandering eyes, they're... Ooh, godly one. I have a hurtful or unpleasant one. Let's take a look. Godly, uh, yep. And that's why. Superior. Pleasant, superior. Yeah, let's keep the godly one. And... I'm gonna sell off the other two because you can't craft them into anything. And, godly. Yeah, hardcore mode, you are just constantly fighting stuff. Hence the reason why I'm so bandaged up in the mummy outfit. <laughs> and I'm still trying to get enough uh, armor material. That means the ores, mithril, adamantite, and things like that. So I can hopefully not die every 20 seconds when I leave my house. Well, I wasn't expecting Skeletron to pop in there. I'm really not ready for him. He's going to be a very difficult, hard fight. I may not even be able to solo him. And I'm really hoping I can solo these bosses. Possessed armor. Yeah, hardcore mode is just... You're going to die a lot. I don't know any YouTubers, any gamers... Who have done hardcore mode and then say they died a lot. Yeah, the crimson's really spreading faster than I want it to. <coughs> Technically, this is all crimson, even though I threw some holy water trying to turn it into a hallow to stop it. But yeah. Well, that's that. Let's. Return and put that away. And it so far, I haven't seen any different selling things to different merchants and all. I haven't really figured out anything. They all seem to give the same price. Also, got some golden rabbit skin, a new key, yada 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 yada. I think I can combine that with this to get something good, but not 100% sure. Let's put this in. I still need to make the uh, star cannon thingy -ma -bobber, bobber and get that done. I've got some potions and all I need to throw away. I'm going to make a medical ward later, and it's mostly going to have beds, desks, things like that. I think actually I'm going to make that to the left of the base and make it an own separate area just so she's on the floor. <laughs> yeah, I hate myself. That way the nurse is on the floor easier to get to. So let's see. Come on. Oh, wait. Went a little too high. I thought for sure you could... Oh, wait. Yep. Before I do that, let me go down to Coleman. Alright, I gotta talk to you. A fines again? Are you kidding me? A fart in a jar, uh... Hmm. I don't really want to make it at the moment. So, I'm going to do some research. And then I may make it. I may not. Can I make anything with this? Yeah, just that. 
it depends if it crafts into anything above it. Because I know, uh, I think you need three upgraded balloons, and then you can make the bundle of balloons or something. And these things have just, to let you know what's been going on in this, I have been fighting blood moons and slimes almost every single night and day. It is just, it's gotten to the point where I'm just here kind of going, really? Freaking really? I mean, it's just that depressing. Here, let's take a look at achievements real fast. Most of mine, bone, steel, spelunk. Like, obtain a ball summoning object, jeep creepers. What am I missing? Quick to pair wings, defeat the three more thingies. I'm drowning, aren't I? Alright, uh, I'll look up achievements later. You all don't need to see that. I'll probably be on a non hard mode world when I look at them, because this is truly insane. So yeah, I'm just gonna stay here, try to kill as many of these as I can right now. And then I'm gonna fight the, uh, boss, the Slime King. Just fight him, see what he drops. I guess why, uh, I wait on more slimes than him to pop up, I think you have to kill X amount of slimes before he does. I'm... I'm going to talk about what I'm doing here. Now, I'm going to lower it down into the underground a little bit. You can see right here, everything's being changed. Everything. This bottom part's going to be mainly uh, stone bricks and... I'm just going to call it winter wood, because I can't pronounce what it really is. It's this wood right here, where my cursor is at. I'm just going to... Uh, I'm going to shut this door just so they stop getting in. Let me kill what's here, though. <clears throat> this is just going to be regular stone bricks and everything. Then right here, I'm going to make it out of granite. And I think once I hit uh, where it says underground, you can't build anymore. Not 100% sure. So once I get that's done and move everyone down you're gonna see a complete change because right now I just need to get them out of the way upstairs I also need to make a single player world where I just go and it has to have gold and with that I'm just pretty much going to use it blast minded everything like that may go ahead and spread the hallow in it I don't know for sure. And it won't have anything like major. It truly won't be one that I stream. It's just going to be there for resources. Because I need things like gold and... Archeum and... Yep, here he is. Things like that. Gold, Archeum, uh... Etc, etc, etc. Will you get off of me? That's what she said. Here, I'll even do a potion to make you feel like you're doing something good. Oh, goodness. Alright, we're done. Yep. And it's a lead door I keep running into. So it's like really solid, really thick, it's a bit soft. But I'm just running into it. What did we get? Those can be sold. That can just be put in a old equipment. Old armor type of deal. I'm, I'm going to sell this solidifier because I have so many already. And here's the wizard. So buy that for me. Buy that for me. 
Buy this from me. Yeah, that's all I'm gonna sell him except for these lenses. I have 99 of those. I can honestly summon so many eyeballs right now, it's not even funny. And I may, once I get some higher tier armor, I may just see how many can I summon and how many can I kill. <clears throat> I need to see what these do. I know this is used for crafting, that's something. I think think he sells the rods depending on which biome he's in, and technically he's living in an icy biome, so who knows. I have no use for this anymore. Hmm. Have I shown off Blackbeard? I don't think I have. I got him during that pirate episode. So let's run up and talk to him. He sells sells pirate stuff, cannon, cannonball. I might buy that later just to see what it's like. But let's finish talking about everything right up here. One uh right here. I'm extending these rooms out a bit, so there are 30 block total, and it's going to go up. From here down, it's going to be changed to the wood again for the sidings, and we're going to keep going up a bit more with the copper plating, so the copper is probably going to come up to about right here or something. Then I may do a gold I'm thinking either gold tungsten something. Something what's that? Rarish. What is that? Oh, nothing. Okay. So that's gonna be something like that. And if I can I'm gonna make an underground room out of the obsidian blocks and hell and stuff and try to make it look a bit like a nightclub or something. I don't know. There's a few things I've done in the multiplayer world, which I'll show off later. I won't tell you how much of a pain it was to build this, because it's an optical illusion right here. This looks bigger than this, but according to the measurements and everything, it's not. It's just optical illusions. I'm hoping. <laughs> I brought in Exile. He started looking at it, too, with me. It took us two hours let me say that again two hours to make sure everything was symmetrical I don't want to do this ever again I do not want to do this ever again because it was that much of a pain any new buildings I do I'm definitely measuring before I even start building that way I exactly know what I want to do and that's why we have these meteor blocks. I'm also keeping those because they just kind of look cool right there. But, yeah, not much to talk about right now. Um, let's talk about the news real fast. Ashley Moore website. I cannot stop laughing about that. For viewers and all knows, it's a website where you go to cheat. And I'm not talking test grades or something like that. No, to cheat on your partner, cheat on your girlfriend, cheat on your wife, husband, whatever. It's one of those adult sites. And it's a whole thing of just cheating. Adultery, things like that. Stuff that's a massive issue to me. I don't tolerate adultery. I don't tolerate cheating, that type of stuff. It's... I went through the pain of having someone cheat on me and having someone leave me for someone else. And I just, I can't rationalize it. I cannot deal with it, whatever. But anyways, Ashley Moore website got hacked. And the hack hackers publicly released. Let me say that again. Publicly released. 
the data. That means everyone who was on it got released to someone else. That means right now it is a field day for divorce lawyers. Because there's going to be a lot of divorces going on. There was a lot of celebrities, VIPs such as congressmen, CEOs, things like that, who just got nailed because they were on the site. And with that said, I think that if you are in Congress and your name was on this website and it was proven that you were on this website, you should leave your office immediately. If not, you need to be forcefully removed by internal services. Because that just shows that you can't be faithful to your partner. How can you be faithful to the American people? You're just looking out for yourself, not the people. And I don't want to sound like a communist or anything, but when you're a leader, you really need to stop looking after yourself. You have people you have to look after. They become your responsibility. So this backhanded dealing, this immoral action, stuff like that. If I found out you had that, and you were one of my congressmen, even if I voted for you, I would then be saying, uh, you need to go. So that's a matter of honor. It's a matter of, can we trust you? It's a matter of a whole bunch of things. Anyways... Are you selling anything new? Uh, Hellfire arrows and explosive powder. The powder can be crafted with the empty gun casings things to make exploding rounds. Um, what else is there? Uh, how do you even pronounce his name? Yeah, they can be crafted with these. And someone else sells stuff that can be used for in it. Now let's check on the status because she's not going to like me. Yeah, 7% Hallow, 13% Crimson. And that was from the 5% we started out with. And it's spreading like wildfire. Anyways. Any boss fights and stuff like that that pop up until I'm ready, I'm just going to let the bosses kill me. And that way I don't really fight them. I don't learn what works against... Ooh, okay. no platinum coin. Yay. That way I don't learn what works against them, things like that. It will be completely wrong. As you can see, I already have a mechanical eye to summon the twins. I'm not ready. I am completely and totally not ready to fight them. But, anyways, with that said, I'm going to end this episode off right here. I have no idea what I'm going to name it at the moment. But, yeah, I hope to see you all in the next one. Like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't already. Each like and comment and subscription helps me. Comments help me by telling me what I did wrong, what I did right. Subscriptions help me... Well, several different ways. Uh, monetarily, I do get paid per subscription. Subscriptions help and increases my revenue chances. Uh, liking the video also helps to get me out there. Share the videos. More people, the better. And I'm not just doing this all because the money. No. The money helps out a lot. The money will allow me to get better equipment, make better videos, things like that. But... Liking and everything like that allows me to tell, hey, you all actually want to watch my stuff. And it helps me more out emotionally, and it makes me want to keep doing the videos. If I go, like, weeks and all where I've been posting videos and no one likes, no one comments, it's depressing. It really drags me down. But anyways... I'm just going to continue to build after I get some breakfast and maybe a cup of coffee. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.